A lot of men have been hearing about urinary tract infection, UTI, but they don't know what it entails. They don't know how it comes about and they don't know the dangers involved. Which is why they take it so lightly when they contract it because they feel it's one of these infections and back, 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 it will just go away. If this is your first time of coming across my video, you are highly welcome. Please endeavor to subscribe to my channel and click on the notification bell to get notified each time I make a new post. Do you know that urinary tract infection causes erectile dysfunction? Urinary tract infection is an infection when microbes enter the urinary tract. It is also known as UTI and is mostly caused by bacteria. Most people don't know how dangerous urinary tract infection is and they don't know the extent at which it can go to cause damages. Some of the causes of erectile dysfunction in men today is as a result of an untreated urinary tract infection. Now you will ask, how does urinary tract infection cause erectile dysfunction? When a man has urinary tract infection, that is UTI, the nerve that controls the blood flow to the penis that helps it to get an erection can be damaged. In addition to that, urinary tract infection can also cause infertility in men. This is because the bacteria can spread across the prostate gland, the testicles and other reproductive organs, which can result to decreased sperm count and motility. What are the symptoms of UTI in men? 1. When you experience frequent urination like you're always passing out urine, at every short time you're going to pee, it shows you have UTI. 2. Always having persistent urge to urinate, even when the urine is not coming out but you're having that urge to urinate. 3. Burning, tingling or painful sensation while urinating or after urinating. 4. When your urine is cloudy and has a foul smell odor. 5. When you experience blood in your urine, that is hematuria. 6. Always having abdominal pain. 7. Having body pains and always feeling tired. Apart from the fact that UTI can result to erectile dysfunction, low sperm count and infertility, it can also result to kidney disease. Some of the kidney diseases out there are sometimes caused by untreated urinary tract infection. How to test for urinary tract infection? To test for UTI, you will produce a urine sample into a sterile universal bottle that will be given to you in the laboratory. The name of the test is urinalysis and urine MCS. The best time for you to produce urine is the early morning urine. Not that you just walk into the laboratory, you produce urine and give to them. No. It is the urine that you pass out in the early hours of the day around that 5 6 a.m that early hours of the day that is the urine you will produce for them to use i know you will ask why is it that it's early morning urine is it not still my body that is coming out this that this that reason why it is more advisable is the early morning urine has a uniform volume concentration and a lower ph Another reason is that the level of bacteria and chemicals in the urine is more higher in the morning. Let's say you went to the laboratory today to go and collect the bottle for you to produce the sample tomorrow morning. Please, by 10 p.m. today, don't drink water again. This is to enhance the concentration of your urine. I know that normally you can pee in between the night, maybe around 1 a.m., 2 a.m., it is okay. Don't pee that one into the bottle. Pee the one that you wake up in the morning, like the dawn of a new day. As you wake up from your bed, normally you will go and pee. That is the one you produce. How do you produce the sample? If you're about peeing, the first few drops from your penis, pee it into the toilet. Pee the next one into the bottle and fill it up. Then pee the remnant back to the toilet. You are just giving the laboratory the urine between the first and the last. That is the one in the middle. It is known as midstream urine. Reason why it is so is while urinating, urine can touch the skin of your penis. And normally, we have normal flora, we have bacteria on our skin. And if there is a bacteria on the skin, it can grow in your results. So it is very essential you don't miss this method if you want to have an accurate result. Once the result is out, please take it to your doctor for interpretation and commence treatment immediately. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe.